If you want to draw an arc, there are a few tools at your disposal. There is the arc tool, the two-point arc tool, and the three-point arc tool. With the arc tool, you begin by setting a center point. And once you do, you'll notice SketchUp pops up a protractor, which will help you set the start and end of your arc, based on the angle you want. You can also specify your angle by typing it in the measurements box. Note that angles are measured in degrees. The two-point arc tool. Click to define the two end points of your arc and pull to create the bulge. You'll notice that this tool doesn't rely on the protractor. The three-point arc tool allows you to draw an arc based on a pivot point. Your first point defines the start of the arc. The second establishes a pivot point and the third defines the end of the arc. If we go back to the two-point arc tool, you'll see that SketchUp shows you inference directions to help you draw in the correct plane. You can also type in the exact radius needed, and if it's a semicircle you need, SketchUp will show you a hint when you found it. SketchUp will also tell you when your arc is tangent to the edge of the object you're working on. Start a line on an edge, then hover the end over the other edge and trace along it until it snaps and changes to the color magenta. Click and move your mouse until it turns magenta again. You'll also know when you're at a tangent when the hint tangent to edge pops up.